G'day YouTube, 1MJ here and welcome back to my channel. So, a lot of people come to the cryptocurrency space and, you know, they hear about the massive money that's been made and everyone wants to make, you know, a million dollars or millions of dollars. Well, let's have a look and see what it would actually take. Now, there's some good news and there's some bad news. The good news is it can be done. But guess what? It can be done in any market. The sad news is is it generally takes a bit of capital. I would say at the sort of very least to make a million dollars, you're probably gonna need a thousand dollars or more. And really, even a thousand dollars is gonna really push it. And we're talking US dollars because that's what we're gonna talk about. So if you had a thousand US dollars and you got lucky and you got a hundred or a thousand X on a coin, we're well, gonna make a million dollars. The thousand X anyway, not so much the hundred X. A uh, thousand times a hundred, that's only one hundred thousand. So they're the kind of odds that you're looking at. But look, it's it's not impossible. And we're going to have a look at some things. So let's have a look at Bitcoin. At the moment, Bitcoin is eleven thousand dollars. There's talk that Bitcoin will go to maybe a hundred thousand dollars. If it does, you're going to need ten. You need to have ten Bitcoin. So at the moment, you would need roughly a hundred and ten thousand dollars. And at the peak of the cycle, if it gets to 100,000, then you're gonna have your million dollars. Now look, there's talk about Bitcoin going a lot higher as well. Talk about 200,000, 300,000, half a million dollars, 600,000. Obviously, the more it goes up, then the less you need. But roughly, you're gonna need 10 Bitcoin to make a million dollars in this bull run, if it plays out the way that people are thinking of. Let's have a look at Ethereum. All right, Ethereum currently, $428. Now, depending on you know who you listen to, there's talk that Ethereum will be somewhere between $5,000 and $10,000. Let's round it off and say it gets to $5,000. We'll go the low end. And again, look, it might not even get to $5,000. It could be less. It's all-time high was $1,400. So even $5,000, that is basically a 10x move from once it hits 500. So that's it's a similar kind of thing. Basically, you're going to need roughly about 100 Ethereum, and if they 10x from 500 and they get to $5,000, you know, you're starting to get towards your million dollars. Now, again, there's no guarantees it could go to $10,000, and then obviously uh, $10,000, you need 100 of them, you've got your million, but if it doesn't, if it goes to 5,000, then you need a whole lot more. But what I wanna have a look at is something that a lot of people are talking about at the moment. So Yearn Finance. So this hasn't been out very, very, very long at all. 30 days, it's gone up 700%. Now it could go up a whole lot more. Now when it came out, the earliest price I can find is roughly about $34. So let's say you put $1,000 into that at $34. You're gonna have a few. I would say by now, you probably wouldn't be too far off your million dollars. 700%, you're nearly getting to that kind of, you know, thousand percent return, 10x and, you know, and beyond. So, can it be done? Yes, but unfortunately, you generally need to put in a fair amount of money. Minimum, I would say, it would be a thousand dollars for most people. And you would have to get lucky and hope that it thousand x's. Now, that's not likely to happen. And again, you put a thousand dollars into uh, Yearn Finance, at $34 and it's now worth $33,000 each, you know, again, you, you, you're probably cheering, you're doing pretty well, but this is not normal. And I am slightly skeptical about whether this can hold. Now look, it could continue to go even higher again, who knows, but this is generally what we call unsustainable. That's that whole parabolic move. Not so much this, but definitely that. And now it's trading sideways. Don't get me wrong, it could have more legs in it and it could have a whole lot more. There's people talking about this going to uh, 100,000. I mean, it's worth more than Bitcoin at the moment. Uh, again, I'm skeptical, you know. I, I, we'll just have to wait and see exactly what this does. But what I'm trying to say is that, yes, you can make a million dollars in crypto. You can make a million dollars in the stock market, though. But the difference is the stock market, you're going to need a lot more money to, to you know make a million than you are in the crypto uh, currency space. But crypto is highly volatile because it's highly dangerous. 
That's why some of these things, you earn finance, we could come back in two or three weeks' time, even 24 hours' time, although I doubt 24 hours, and this could be bust. There could be a bug in the system and it all falls apart and then it's worth nothing. The guy who created this, uh, Andre, oh, I can't remember how to pronounce his last name, he even said Yearn Finance Token has no intrinsic value. It's not worth anything, but it's currently now worth $33,000. Now, that's not to say that it uh, you know, he wasn't trying to undersell it. It possibly is worth thirty-three thousand, and maybe it's worth a hundred thousand. We just don't know. But these kind of returns in a month, seven hundred percent. It's not. Yeah, it's generally not sustainable. We'll have to wait and see what happens. In another thirty days, this could have gone up to thousand x. We'll have to wait and see. Who knows? But you know. Just be careful. That, that's all I would say to people. Now, we're looking in the top 100, really in the top 100 to make a million dollars from any of the coins in the top 100. Again, you'd have to be investing and it'd be more than $1,000. I don't think there's any coins inside the top 100 where if you put $1,000 into them uh, and you'll be able to make a million dollars. I'm not saying it's impossible. You're more likely gonna have to get dangerous and so it comes down to your risk appetite you know what are you willing to you know put on the line have you got a thousand dollars that you can you know basically put it all on black is you know what it would be like uh, and just take a wild bet because back in here now you put a thousand dollars into some of these you might make a million dollars they definitely could 100 1000 X or more now I'm not saying any of these in particular but this is where generally the big dollars are made. People will come and find some coin, generally something new. Uh, a lot of these older ones, Quantstamp, you know, they, they were around back in 2017. They haven't been doing a whole lot. They uh, do security audits for uh, cryptocurrency platforms and things like that. Uh, I haven't heard too much of them lately. Uh, and they're trading at four cents. So, you know, their all time high. Let's have a look. What was Quantstamp's all time high? Let's say you put $1,000 in and at four cents. Let's have a look at max. What was their max price? All right, what did we get to? All right, so it was worth 76 cents. So, yeah, I think you'd be hard up uh, to put $1,000 into Quantstamp, and if it got to its all-time high, you know, you would have done well, but there's no guarantees that it will, and it's been, you know, flatlined a little bit, the whole bear market, but, you know, what coins haven't? But we'll have to have a look because it looks like it might be gaining some momentum here. And they still are around. They still are active. So let's have a look. What's happened? Well, there we go. In the last 30 days, in the last year, they're already up 300%. So it was four, it's at four cents now. It was probably a whole lot cheaper back here. So it was less than a cent. That's really where you'd want to get in. You know, if you can find something for a cent or less, you know, and you start to put in a thousand dollars, then it won't take much for that to turn into a million dollars. Don't get me wrong, it's still going to have to, you know, thousand X, but that's where you're likely to make a million dollars. But if we go back to the top 100 to try and make a million dollars from any of the top 100, you're going to have to front some capital. A lot more than a thousand dollars. A thousand dollars is unlikely to make you a million dollars for any of the coins in the top 100. You are literally going to have to go way back again, you know, page three, page four, page five, and find some really low caps. And again, you'd still need to have a thousand dollars or more to make that million dollars. Everything else you're starting to look at, you know, you'd probably have to invest 20, 30, 40, a hundred thousand dollars into them, you know, a hundred thousand dollars. You know, and you 10x, there you go. You've 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 made your you've made your million dollars, but that's not that easy to do. It's not to say it can't be done, and I'm you know I can't guarantee that no coin here you could put a thousand dollars into and make a million. I just think it's highly unlikely. In the top 100, I think you'd be struggling to do that. You'd have to go a lot further back. Anyway, I don't want to take too much of your, more of your time. So 388,000, we're starting to push back up again. Have a quick look at the Bitcoin price. And again, we're just ranging in here. We haven't been able to break above it. We haven't really broken below it. And again, I said the other day, this looks a lot like this. It's very, very similar. 
uh, this move and the dump and all the rest of it and then the fake out we had the fake out over here and then it trades off and gets a little bit lower for a while so we'll have to wait and see whether it's going to repeat stay safe be kind to one another hopefully you're on that gain train and i'll see you next time